In this video, I want to go over an effect called the fish eye effect. Now, as you can see right here, this is what the fish eye effect actually looks like. This effect is most commonly used for uh, gamers that zoomed in distorted look. As you can see, you can mess around with it a little bit. But in this video, I'm going to show you where to find it and how to actually uh, use it. So let's go ahead and just uncheck it right here. Now, what you want to do is you want to head over to the effects panel. Once you're in the effects panel, you want to click on all, head down to the search bar, and just type in the fisheye effect. And go ahead and just drag it onto your video clip or adjustment layer, and basically wherever you're trying to drag it on. So I want to go over a couple of cool effects uh, you can do with this effect. Not quite sure that made a lot of sense. But first, you want to do uh, first thing you want to do is you want to click on the video, and make sure you're clicked onto the effect. And as you can see, you can move the effect effect around and make it just wherever you want the distortion to happen. Whether you want the distortion to happen right here, whether you want the distortion to happen right here, or right in the middle. There you go. It's completely uh, centered. As you can see, it just depends on where you want the distortion to look. I'll press Command Z. There you go. It's back, pretty much back in the middle. Now if you want to click on the clip, you can also head over here to the effects panel right here. You want to first go over here to the effects panel and make sure you're clicked on the fish eye effect. Over here you can adjust the amount. So how much you want it distorted or that just looks really ugly, have no clue why you would uh, have it that, but again, it's like, like all these effects, it's a personal preference. So as you can see the amount, it just depends on how much that's about, that looks right that's about the that's about normal right there so there you go that's close enough to being normal so you can see distorted or that really weird looking effect but that's what you can do first you can also adjust the radius um, I don't think that really does that much the radius isn't that big of a deal it's just the amount how much you want distorted so let's say we want it really distorted let's go ahead click on the video click on the clip and drag it all the way down here now as you can see that looks absolutely beautiful highly highly encourage you to make your video look just like that as you can see that's about Hollywood level a Hollywood level production so highly encourage you to make that video look like that hopefully you can understand sarca sarcasm so please don't ever make your video look like that but it just depends on what effect you want I mean that just looks absolutely uh, ugly Unless, honestly, you want your video to look like that. But like the night vision effect in that video that I made about the night vision effect, it's a personal preference and it's a, it's a special effect, which means that it's only used for like uh, certain situations. Obviously, you don't want your video to look like that, but a lot of times gamers will use uh, this effect just to make their video a lot funnier. So let's go ahead and just, I think the, vo uh, the volume is muted, and let's just play through it. So that's what they did. That's what the... It, it, uh, the distorted look uh, looks like called the fish uh, fisheye effect so hopefully you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that subscribe button I'm giving away a Google Home Mini once I reach 1,000 subscribers see you guys in the next one I upload Final Cut Pro tutorials every single day see you guys in the next one peace